Sweetie, check out my latest creation. What did you do to her? I want to keep an eye out at the party. So you want to spy on her friends? Well, I mean, no, you know, we're always so busy when we host these things that uh, we always forget what happens. So you want to spy on her friends? Basically. I'm in. It's not the monster preteen that lives at the top of the stairs. Hey! Oh, oh. Aaron, you coming to the party? Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know what I want to be. But I made your costume. Yeah, it's a little too on the nose, don't you think? <laughs> All right, who's coming? Um, okay, Rick from the French restaurant. He's married. Hey, Charlie, Grace. Hey! hey. Well, at least she communicates with someone. Shut up, Mom! Mm, the light, the love, the power, the presence. Ah, uh, don't worry, Jules. It's just a phase. Hey, gorgeous. Hey, ladies. Oh, let me see Romani. Hey, how about Louis? Cabrera? Yeah! Oh, God, I dated him six months ago. And? And I'm not coming. Ugh. So, you coming to the party? <laughs> Is Donnie gonna be there? Uh, no, he's uh, taking his nephew trick-or-treating. Right, right. Well, I gotta go, so... Uh... Party starts at 8. Yep. Bye, Aaron. Oh, plenty of food and drink if you have a costume. Sorry about that, I just finished with a patient. Bro, that's sick even for me, asswife. Mm, I know. Hey, nice costume. Oh, Finally an excuse not to shave your back. You know what? I shave something else instead, just for okay. you tonight. I love you. Where, hey, oh, is Aaron here? What I leave my guy hanging? I took care of it. All right. Oh boy. Other hand. Yes, other hand. Yes. You don't have rabies, do you? You know what I do, actually. Hey, wait a minute, wait a minute there. Wait a minute there. Elvis in the house. Oh, Elvis again. Yes, I've been Elvis again, so stop being nothing but an asshole, all right, man? You've been dressing as that since we were 12 years old. Playing up, it's the only time I get laid. I've been at a job in seven months yet, Rick. David, don't you dare leave me with those people like you did last year. I didn't leave you, Angela. You got upset because you saw someone else wearing your costume and you stormed out. Yeah, well, no chance of that this year, is there? So much for leaving things to the imagination. Hey, hey, hey. Somebody call those J 
Chipper? Two houses down. Blind guy. <laughs> you got a bar. Is the love doctor in? I'm not into that kind of love, buddy. It's a rhetorical question. Ah, scariest costume I've seen on this. No, oh, Dr. Bento. Mr. President? <laughs> Big fan. Good to see you. Hello, Mr. Big Host. fan of both of you. Ah, <laughs> uh, this guy. Richard Fry's mother ran a ball house. Anyhow, that's where I got the show business bug. Hey, great, you are here. Hello. Good to see you, thank you. Glad you could make it. I don't know, Jewel. So far, it's all couples and one wolf dude. I'm going home. There's gonna be a lot of people here. Oh, well, there's a homeless guy in the alley. Maybe I should just bring him for my date, huh? <laughs> well, I mean, what would you look for in a guy? I look for the huge bulge. Where he keeps his wallet. D.W. Griffin? I am Cecil B. DeMille. Okay. D.W. Griffith is a whore. Now, here's how I see it, okay? So I've got cameras all around this place, okay? Mm -hmm. So I want to catch the things that other people will miss. Now, there's still gonna be gaps, right? And that's where you come in. I want you to film the gaps. I want you to film, pretend that you're filming, but actually really be filming. Ah, uh, so cinema verite, verite. Nice outfit. Oh, thanks. It's not working, is it? Uh, oh no, it works. No, uh, the outfit. Oh, it's that obvious, is it? <laughs> hey, come up, you're missing all the fun. Ham it up, of course, because people be, you know, uninhibited. They think you're a character. They're going to play along. But I want some dirt. <laughs> Can you do that for me? You understand who you're talking to? I'm Cecil B. DeMille, the most nuanced, subtle director in the history of Hollywood. So, uh, where's your date? Don't need one. Where's yours? That's a long, long story. Show you from around here? Um... Just up the street a little bit. Oh, last minute costume. Works for me. Oh. I'm coming, I'll be right there. Ugh, I don't know. Okay, I'll be right there. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> There's that little cougar. Come on up here, Aaron. Yeah. God, I do not believe this. Here, come with me. Do not look up. Just, just come with me. Don't look up, just come. Just Anyway, I get final cut. That's the deal. Uh, uh, of course. That's the course. deal. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Seems like a nice guy. Man's a fucking moron. Final cut. My middle name is Final Cut. Cecil B. Final Cut DeMille. Nice touch to the costume entering through the alley. Genuine. <laughs> oh. uh, maybe you didn't have to be so authentic with the smell. Well, I take Halloween very seriously. Jesus, have you seen Moses? I got a film to finish, for God's sakes. No, but let me know if you need a stand and I could totally do Moses, dude. All right. Some people just look evil. Inviting Donnie? Oh, hi. Uh, yeah, no, don't look at me. I, I thought Donnie was trick or treating with his nephews. Hey, uh, have you met the Dominatrix? That's exactly right. Who's my husband? He's a schemer. I know he is. Yeah, coming to the party alone. I see, huh? Nice. Should've called me back. Could've hit the carpool lane, huh? Yeah. By the way, a little secret here. Already gotten off twice tonight. If you play your cards right, go for a third. <laughs> Shit, yeah. That is hot, by the way, too. Really hot. Like, tits up all the way. You don't need any, uh, tool to find this stuff. What does that mean? What's that? Red means stop. Really. This? Will be the greatest show on earth. Oh, yes, it will, my man. Cheers to that. Yeah. Here you go, sweetie. Oh, thank You're you sweetie. so much, honey. What? Who says that? Kiss ass. Thank you for rescuing me. My pleasure. <laughs> What's that smell? 
It's weird. It's like I guess it's like Julie's burning her floral incense or something. I don't know. Yeah, I smell think it, it is. You smell it? Yeah, I do. So do you think that JFK was killed over like the whole Maryland thing? You know, between the Bay of Pigs and the Cuban Missile Crisis, maybe it was Hoover that had him assassinated. Hoover? I love my Hoover. Best vacuum ever. <laughs> Said a girl, preach it. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go party. Thanks for the drinks, honey. You can't park here. I just did. You're such an ass. Listen, there's enough room for other cars to drive by. I don't know why you had to start drinking two hours before we even got here. Do you want to know why? Because I had to spend one hour with you in this car on the drive over. Most importantly, tonight is my night off and I'll do whatever I want. You, know, you act like you have it so bad with me. Listen, just do me a favor. For one night, just one night, lay off. That's all I ask, one night. Get off me, you're gonna rip my dress, you idiot. I bought it. Some extra. There you go. Thank you. And one more. I like my powder in a line, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Who needs e-harmony when the love doctor is here? <laughs> All right, so uh, what's your poison? Mason, right? Yes. How about just a glass of red? Ah, can I interest you in a glass of the Chateau du Vampire? <laughs> Sounds bloody interesting. By the way, you have some amazing pieces of art in here. Mm. Well, you know, some men stalk and kill animals for fun. I hunt art for the thrill of falling in love with it. And then I sell it for a higher profit. <laughs> oh, Downey boy. Have you met Mason? Dude, there, are some, yeah, there are some bodies in this house. Oh, have yeah. you seen that? Yeah. That devil has no underwear on. Yeah. That's interesting. Hell yeah, I know. Yeah. It's like not. Look, 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 the legs are open. All right, all right. Wow, is that stupid glass? Dude, are you kidding me? Stupid glass? You always make a habit of putting down people's trinkets and dust collections, hippie? Peace, my canis brother. Yeah, peace. Okay, listen, take the, the hair out of your ears, okay? S-T-E-U-B-E-N. And yes, this is no trinket, okay? This piece was handcrafted in the early 19th century. How do you know that? That is an expensive piece. Are you just rambling, or, or do you know what you're talking about? Seriously, this guy is an idiot. Wow, he's a friendly guy. Yes, uh, Donnie is a hunter, not a lover. And you, my new friend, happen to be the lucky guy that's standing between him and his prey tonight. Yikes, I'll watch myself. Yeah. Thank you. Hey! hey! The happy couple's finally arrived. Now that's a trio like to climb. <laughs> Brady Bunch, without the bunch. Hey, uh, it's my favorite couple. Hi. Hi. Wow, what the heck are you oh, supposed to oh. be? She's a stud finder. <laughs> Look no further, oh. beautiful. Wow. Um, I think your sword is stabbing me. Okay. Damn boy. You need a drink. Oof. Hey. Take note of what my connections at Warner Brothers got us. Oh, is that where those rags came from? Yeah. This is an authentic costume worn in Pirates of the Caribbean Dead Man's chest. Oh, nice. uh -huh. Remember the scene on the ship where there are like hundreds of pirates fighting? <laughs> Come on, I cannot be the only one paying attention to these things. Yeah, well, don't lawyers always pay attention to the pointless, trivial details? The skinny guy that got stuffed through the eye by Johnny Depp? It's the skinny guy costume. No! No, the skinny pirate fell on top of another part that had a sword in his back. That's the costume. Oh, of course. Yeah. Now, 
Do you have any drinkable scotch or should I drink from my spring bar? Okay, you know what? I'm not even trying to keep up with you, Jones. <laughs> have at it. <laughs> so, uh, how are the girls? Oh, they're magnificent. Oh, okay. Elizabeth just won her third straight regional championship. She's headed straight for Miss California, I'm sure, and she's only 17. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and Catherine, well, you may have heard that Catherine is the new Miss Orange County. We're so proud. And Constance, well, she was just voted her school's homecoming queen. I mean, she says she's not really the pageant type, but apparently the student body thinks otherwise. <laughs> and the twins, they just entered their very first pageant. And get this, the judges had to declare a tie because they couldn't choose between them. <laughs> Isn't that funny? <laughs> oh. <laughs> so how's Megan? So between you and me, she's uh, just as possessed as usual. Am I in the right place? Of course you are. That was so much fun, my I god. Know. Can I borrow these? Come on, more, more, Whoa. come on. Just tender, just tender. Oh, what do you think? Oh, that looks wow. good on you. It matches your uniform. Oh, my god. oh come, come on, on. do it like you mean it. Do it like you mean it. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Thinks it's gonna get real romantic? You turn on and you like on a dime and you make him behave. Tony, totally. take those come five on. fingers. Give you till you come on. Come on. Come on. Bad boy, bad boy, bad boy. Get him. Push him down, bad push him down, push him down. Bill, hey, I see you went all out this year. Well, you know, it's all in the present day. Oh, TMI, 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 TMI. You know, you better slow it down or you're going to be on your face and embarrass the hell out of me. Woman, I plan on breaking the fun barrier tonight. And unless you plan on joining me, you need to lay the fuck off. Birds. Are you having fun yet? Oh, yeah, baby, you've got to dance with me, baby. Come on. Yeah. It's me and you. And you. Doesn't it bother you that your wife is practically naked? Hell no. That's when I love her the most. Oh, hey! Hi. So, what are you? Phantom of the Forest? Ah, oh, cute. <laughs> A pretty oh. fan. Oh, thank you, nurse. I need a drink. Hey, 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 hey. 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 The sexy cave girl on the naughty. When are you going to take us out in that huge booty? Yeah. Yacht. Yeah, yacht. Just give me the magic word. Word. Hey, come on, let's do it. Let's go. Yeah. Notice that lesbians in real life don't look anything like lesbians in porn. It's such a ripoff. Hey, Julie, you don't mind if I use your master bath, do you? Sure. That one's in there. Yeah, sure, you know where it is. Okay. What I've crossed out, I didn't like. What I didn't cross out, I'm dissatisfied with. Cecil, can you give my guests a break, man? I'm an artist. Ask your husband. Whoa, Angela! Oh, sorry. I thought you were someone else. Continue. You're here for your reading, Mrs. Uh... No. I don't really believe in all that stuff. Well, of course you don't, but it's Halloween. Sit down. All right. So what do you want to know? I want to know if my husband's cheating on me. You really want to know? Mm. Fine, fine. Trick or treat. Crayons, not candy. Oh, gee, what did I ever do to deserve this? Thank you, you're welcome. You get what you get. Brad. Oh my. I knew it. Oh, not so fast. I see a lot of young women around. Yeah, the sorority girls. No. Yeah, no, 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 no. These young ladies happen to look a lot like you. Do you have children? Five, to be exact? 
Yeah. Well, that explains one group. One group? How many groups are there? Well, there's, uh, and, um, blah, 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 uh, two. Oh, this and, is ridiculous. He's a lying cheat. I knew it. Can you blame him? Aye. marriage and I find out this way? I knew it all the late nights at work, all the pro bono work at the sorority house. You motherfucker, I knew it! Pat, I need more drama. Dig deeper. Was I talking to you bug eyes? How many times has it been? Has there ever been a time that you've been faithful to me? Hey. Oh, vegetarian? Oh, no. I can't seem to stay away from the seafood. You? Well, I used to be. Really? It's not very often that somebody who has a healthy lifestyle goes in the opposite direction. Well, I guess you could say I'm kind of a forager. Have you ever heard of the Paleolithic diet? Sounds prehistoric. A little bit, a little bit. It's also referred to as the hunter-gatherer diet. And for us romantics, the Adam and Eve diet. Early man had very few choices. Early man only needed one choice. Whoa. Is that a C cup? <laughs> you know, actually, it looks that way. I'm gonna leave you guys to it. <laughs> what? Something I said? Ah. Hey, there's my camera. Cool. Excellent, guys. Let me get your picture. Hang on, hang on. That looks, that's cool. Far out. Think of the homeless guy. He smells kind of funny. He's in character. Really? <laughs> okay, let me get this straight. You're going to a party, you're getting ready, and you think to yourself, let me just rub some garbage on me. That'll really get the ladies going. Uh, <laughs> no. no. Do, you th do you think he's really homeless? Did you ask him where he lives, what he does for a living, what kind of car he drives? Uh, no, because I'm not shallow and we've been having deeper conversations than that. Aaron, I'm gonna go out on a limb here, but I think that you might be hitting the bottom. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so who do you suggest? I mean, we got Zeus, the guy with the hair, and we got the Pope. Mm -hmm. Um, what about the prison inmates? Yeah. Gay. Obama. Married to Palin. What about the Grim Reaper? Oh, no, 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 no. I, I dated him like a year ago. He left me feeling dead inside. <laughs> the mammogram guy. Oh. What? <laughs> After a couple cocktails, who cares? Hey, lucky lady. I think you just found yourself a stud. You think your tools are right for the job? Um, no. Bye-bye. Dance with me, baby. <laughs> Come on, one dance. Oh. You know, I was just about to ask you to dance, but it looks like you beat me to the punch. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I promised someone else, but... Maybe later? Sure. <laughs> hey, Jimmy. What do you think? What do you think of this one we just arrested? It ain't she a saucy little tot? Oh, yes, sir, she is. A I like the schoolgirl outfit there. It's quite nice, and the fishnets is really is. quite sexy. Why is she wearing your hat? I don't know. Why are you wearing my hat, young lady? Give me that back. Because the cop said so. The cop? Who's the cop?
is the enlightened woman? She was just here a minute ago. Oh, wow, that's so convenient. Maybe she wasn't even here. No, she was, and she was very authentic. You're late for your reading. Uh, oh, pardon me. No, please, sit. May I see your hand? You are gonna make a huge difference. Sometimes I wonder. You're human, it's natural. Don't walk away from your plan. It just seems so far away. Maybe it's for the wrong reasons, I don't know. No one needs to know why they made the choices that you made. There will always be doubts along the way. Again, it's natural. You set things into motion despite your doubt and you learn to trust what you set into motion and continue. Tell me about the stud finder. She is a good soul, lost. She has baggage, but then again, don't we all? They miss you. You do know that? Thank you. You must not deviate. Many lives depend on it. You know what? I write you a prescription. You guys look like you have uh, ADD or ADHD. How about some uh, Ritalin or uh, a Percocet? Um, what do you think? Got any Vicodin? Perfect. Excellent. Doctor signature. And there you go. Enjoy. Thanks. Thanks. Honey, I'm looking for a CEO, and there's not one at this party. And the whole costume thing is fucking with me. So, I can't tell who's who. There is not enough liquor in this place to get me to stay. You guys, I am not going anywhere because Aaron has just informed me that Mr. Donnie apparently is very, very well hung and uh, I find him kind of attractive now. <laughs> oh my God, shut the fuck up. So I think that we can just hang out just a little bit longer. Okay, yes. I'll be your wing girl. Okay, no, thank I you. Saw Jesus doing the singer songwriter folksy thing at the coffee shop the other day. He's not bad. Go for it. Oh, Fantastic! <laughs> How's a little funky? Oh, well, she's not so little anymore. Huh? Yeah, we now refer to her as Teen Zilla. <laughs> oh, yes. That's it's my little true. thing. Well, little and 15 are two different words. Oh, my. Okay. Uh, basically, she's an alien yes. trying to suck out our life force. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Although, Halloween is like her perfect holiday because when it's over, we hope she goes back to her sweet little self. Yeah. Oh, you guys are too much. <laughs> <laughs> so, where's the little angel so we can yeah. see her for ourselves? Uh, Have you had your shots lately? Oh. Uh, <laughs> All right, well, just don't say we didn't warn you. Okay. She's tricky. All right. Well, okay, two flights up, end of the hall, do not disturb sign on the door, and that is for your protection. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh, are you ready? You go first. Okay, <laughs> here we go. Swim on up, please. I'll see you in a bit. Right. I don't know, honey. Maybe we should have just shown them a recent picture. <laughs> No, you are treating me like shit. Stop doing that, I'm okay? I'm not treating you like shit. No, you treat I just me like a shit. husband that respects me. What the fuck? We have a problem in Sector 9. What's going on? Watch. Oh, well, it looks like big fancy cars and expensive homes aren't all they're cracked up to be, huh? And don't forget about the boob job. Oh, man. I knew something was going on with those guys. Yeah. 
Well, not everyone can be as disgustingly yummy as we are. Aww. I don't know. I'm still worried about Meg. I mean, she didn't want to go to Graham's tonight. Well, I don't blame her. But then she didn't want to go to her friends either. Well, obviously she likes torturing us. I am serious. I know, sweetie. I know. It's just, I don't know. Maybe we need some alone time. You know, get out of Dodge. I can, actually, I can actually put like scratch marks over each and every one of your backs. Ah, Simultaneously. Oh. Same time. Yeah. Yeah. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Talent. Donnie, <laughs> there's a spider. <laughs> Yeah, we're definitely looking for a threesome. Hello! No, 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 no. Definitely not you. Wifey. We'll take her, though. We can always use her. Mm-hmm. Just something to drink. Not nearly enough for the situation. Bye. Dude, you're gonna get someone a seizure with that thing. Turn it off, please. Who's here tonight? Who? Jesus. Oh, yeah? Wanna make him a Bloody Mary, huh? Oh, 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 oh! Ah, boy. Oh, I don't get it. Of course you don't. Anyway. Can I get you anything? You know what, actually, what, are you actually taping every buddy, everything here tonight? Of course. What's the point of having top of the line video equipment if you don't use it to violate the civil rights of your closest friends? Oh, my violating brother. Oh, wait a minute. Why don't you put one of those in Megan's room and see what teens are up to? Oh, no, no, no. Hell no. I will not invade her privacy. Oh, no, no. Yes, 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 yes. You think she's in a room right now painting her nails, slapping on silly bands? Shit, no, man. She's out the window. I promise you. Did they brainwash you at the Mall Cop Academy? I just played. Well, anyway, let me see what you're taking there. Let me see that. Come on. Come no, on. no, no. Just come on. No, give me. I just want to see some Okay, I'm all in. Unless Congress objects, in which case, I'm out. Sweetie, can I have the black Amex card? Oh. Oh. And that includes frequent flyer miles. Oh. Seems like the gloves are off. Well, I think I'm gonna throw a couple of carrots into this stew. Yes. Oh. Left those at home. Well, what the hell? How about two weeks in our summer home at Martha's Vineyard? A month. <laughs> All right, done. 1,000 shares of stock in Netflix. Oh, oh, oh no, 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 no. Okay, Google. <laughs> what the hell are you guys doing down here? Oh, run along, Teen Wolf. Adults are playing. Okay, aren't you going to help me get rid of that homeless guy upstairs? Uh, uh no. no. Uh, no. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> a bar in my future. Call. What, what the hell? hell? My house, my rules. Oh. Oh, great. What do we got here? Like a lame Indian princess and a punchy cheerleader. Happy Halloween, girls. Mason, what a nice surprise. Hi, I didn't know you knew Ben or Julie. Oh, actually, we just met. Their friend Aaron brought me. Really? Kumbaya, my lord. Kumbaya. I don't know the next words. All right. <laughs> Thank you, Zayn. Kumbaya, my lord. Charlie, Grace. Hi. Will. How are you guys? Hi. Speak of a devil. Will. 
Will, Mason, Mason, Will. This is the man I told Mason, you about. Mason, right. I like that you're pushing your cause even on the holiday. It's subtle. <laughs> Erin didn't tell us she had such a cute boy toy. <laughs> Just hiding out, you know. <laughs> you know, speaking of Harry, I have this fantasy that I'm... Oh, my God. Do we have to hear this one more time? No, we do, because I haven't heard it, so I'd like to hear this. Oh, Thank you. Anyway, I'm being chased in the forest by this werewolf who is... <laughs> And he's so close to me, mm. I can feel breathing. Okay. I, I can feel Last that. time just... it was a frickin' Sasquatch. Yeah. Make up your mind. We're the same species. What's it's the totally... difference? They're both hairy. Ew. Dying. 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 Hey, hey, Not sorry about time. earlier. <laughs> Not a good time. Damn devils are everywhere. I brought you this. <laughs> the fuck this is that? that? Yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Mini cameras. Shh. As you drink, they monitor everyone around you. Dude, are you kidding? I wouldn't swallow. Ingenious! It's like one of those fishing bother beauties my daddy used to have. Well, that's not what I would have said. I'm just kidding. I'm just joking. <laughs> They're just novelty ice cubes. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> you should drink it, though. You know what? Uh, help you take your mind off of Aaron. Dude, I, I've got a French maid, a cave girl, and an naughty nurse, and we're not going to be playing Operation. Think about it. I don't need this at all. <laughs> Where is that fortune teller you guys hired? What fortune teller? The one that's sitting upstairs in your bedroom telling me about this lying, cheating asshole. Well, keep it up and I'll do it. Oh, really? Fine, Casanova. Why don't you go for it? Fine, with pleasure. I'll do it then. Uh. That's not stopping him. Is, is that true? There's so much. Yeah. Yeah. And George, hey, so you can do dishes. Yeah, I love doing dishes, baby. You know that. Yeah, you like doing dishes for everybody but me. Sure. You know what? That would take more soap than you ever held in front of us. Can you always ride on my ass, baby? Here we go. Oh, oh that might be it. <laughs> oh, wow. There's your door. <laughs> new thing, Kevlar. Your Kevlar. Kevlar? Yes, yes, yes. Wow, they look so natural. Oh, you know what? You should check it out. Really? Sure. Very natural. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Ah. oh. Jeez. Sorry. Oh. 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 No, no, come here, come here. I want to ask what? you something. I want to ask you something. Oh, God, I hate that thing. Kind of looks like your mother. Oh, well, that's nice, honey. <laughs> No more. No, no more. No, this is, this is. Who is the fortune teller? What are you talking about? There's a woman in our room giving out readings. <laughs> Honey, you gotta lay off the drinks. No, I'm serious. Well, maybe you know this mysterious woman. No, 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 no. That's not. I oh, just, oh, 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 I'm the one who asked you. I know, but what do you think? I'm up here conjuring up things? Well, this isn't the work of my spirits. Well, it's none of my spells. <laughs> <laughs> Stay out of the begonias! Urchins! Kids. Bunch of pervs. I should have just stayed home. Ladies, I'm glad you could join us in Jesus' oh. magic hot tub. Us too. You're smoking. Well, no weed. I guess this is the month we need to start mingling with the lowest common denomination. Well, that's quite a statement coming from a woman who puts lipstick on pit bulls. Come on, let's get in. Oh, I never did that. You, you did. Oh, <laughs> Hi. 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 Hi
Thank you. Uh, I don't know there's enough room for two parties in this jacuzzi. Look at those ice cubes. They start a fire. Whoa. Did you guys bring your medicinal cards? Because this stuff is highly regulated. Oh, I have my campaign buttons. I'm sure that's plenty. I've got my uh, birth certificate. That's good for another four years, I think. <laughs> oh, Obama. Look, I think I can see Osama from here. I don't think so. You don't think I would have announced the uh, news of his capture and death to the whole country if I hadn't checked it with Hillary first? Oh. <laughs> Osama Obama. I bet you get a lot of shit for that. Well, last 2,000 years, you've gotten a lot of shit too, my friend. You know, I got a lot of respect for people like you. I really do. Whoa, it smells like a camel's ass out here. Oh, Aaron, <coughs> join us. <coughs> no, thanks. <Aaron>. Oh. <laughs> what did Dr. Ben put in these drinks? Have any of you guys seen Mason? 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 Who? Mason? Who's Mason? The homeless guy. The, the guy that's dressed up like a homeless person. We're all a little homeless, my child. Please, come join us. I give you my blessings. Nothing. It's a placebo effect. Oh, it's oh, working really? for me. <laughs> I've always wanted to say how many losers can they pack under one roof? This is nauseating. Ah, oh, but that's why we're on top of the roof. <laughs> Creativity is a drug I cannot live without. Oh, God. Fucking addicts. Get, get, get out of my... Aaron! <laughs> well, they're sticking cameras in it's my face. It's a party! I'm not camera ready. <laughs> what you doing? Oh, I'm just writing a, a quick note to Meg, Megan. Oh, are you still right, Mommy? Yeah, I like to think it endears me to her. Oh, come on, Jewel. You and Ben are like the best parents ever. <laughs> You're also the best couple. Ugh. Well, next to Charlie and Grace. No, they're better. For one, they don't lie. Uh, what? It, Look, Aaron, I know you're going through a really tough time and that you may think that the grass is greener on the other side, but I'm telling you, it is not always that way. Look, what's, go what's going on? <laughs> okay, Meg found out that we're not married. What? You guys have a kid. So we just never really believed in it, you know? But we're much more committed than most people, especially because of Megan. And she gets to see two people who really love each other, and more than that, that we love her. You know, Aaron, we just decided it doesn't matter what other people think of us. Yeah, that's actually really cool. <laughs> you guys are great. I'm, I'm sure Meg knows that. Well, we've been talking about it, though, you know, like, like a ceremony or maybe like a commitment ceremony with her. And like for all of us, you know, if she can't get through this phase. Here we go. Okay. The light, the love. Power, the presence. Say it with uh, me. Okay. The, the light, light, the love, the power, the presence. <laughs> Let's get you a drink. Yeah, off. that helps Let's too. You. Welcome to the monster party. <laughs> hey, Romani. Hi, David. How are you? Hi. You know what? My wife, look at me. I'm talking to you. Hey, look at me. My wife believes that I'm cheating on her. I'm not cheating on her. What do you say? Do you believe me? What should I do? Okay, let's go to sleep together. Come on, let's sleep together. Come on. Close. My friend's having one too, so we're headed over. Wanna go? Mm, no, I'm just gonna wait here. Why? Because I need to talk to someone, so. Don't tell me you're referring to Mr. Smelly Pants. Hey. Seriously. Come on, that's not nice, really. Oh, well, no one ever said we were nice. <laughs> <laughs> you got that right. Uh, Donnie won't be there. Oh, great. Are you gonna take him? We're taking him. Yep. Come, Come on. on. We are going to help you with your happiness. No, no, no. no. I'm good. Really, seriously, I'm good. I'm happy. Whatever I'm happy. you say, Erin, don't say we didn't try to save you from a life of a cat lady. Yeah. <laughs> Have fun. 
Aaron, way to take the high road. See, my brother knows what he's talking about. Those bitches are hoes. <laughs> you got it right, sis. <laughs> Trick or treat. Oh, honey, wait a minute. I don't have any candy, but I have something better for you here still, okay? Can you take that? Good boy. Okay, here we go. <laughs> there are easier ways to leave a party. <laughs> I am not going anywhere. Yet. Good. Because I wanted to apologize for being such an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can't help it. I deserve that. You're too concerned about what others think. You know, you're not really thinking with your heart. Well, some things can't be trusted. But, I apologize anyway, regardless of my heartlessness. <laughs> it's okay. It's not even on my radar. Well, what is on your radar? I think it's time to make a change. Looks like the green thumb didn't make it to the next generation. Actually, it did. The little garden is just taking some time to find itself. I'm surprised Julie didn't try to fix it. Isn't that what most people do? It's not her style. Her and Ben know that Megan just needs some space. It's just a phase is all. She'll find her way back soon. I know she will. By the way, apology accepted. <laughs> <laughs> Everything okay with Mason? Oh, you know, I don't know. He got really emotional over Megan's garden. But I mean, who wouldn't? This place is so perfect. How do you guys know Mason? Church. Uh, church. Church. Really? I would never have pegged him for a church guy. Uh, be wary of typecasting Aaron. That's true. But, uh, isn't it kind of tonight's theme? <laughs> Has he, um said anything about me. I guess not. I've been kind of a jerk. Erin, there's something you should know about Mason. <gasps> yeah! You know what? I really want to hear this, and I have to talk to you later. I, I gotta go. Yeah! No, no, yeah! No, 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 no. It's the whole hard to get deal. It's like big right now. You two look sexy. Look at that. I can't even tell if you're pissed or not. I like that. <laughs> Hey, stay still. Uh -oh. Hey, where are you going? Well, aren't we a busy little pirate tonight? Hi. Gee, Cole, I never knew you were into such kinky stuff. Hi. Hi, honey. You know, I have a kinky idea of my own. Yay! <laughs> I'm gonna have sex tonight. Oh, I've got plans for you. Cole, oh, sweet dreams, asshole. Welcome to your nightmare. <sighs> Fuck. <sighs> Where are you, you little shit? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I knew it, I knew it. Trick or treat! Oh, what do we have here, a little dog? And what are you, honey? A witch. 
No, honey, I'm a witch. No, you're a creepy tree and a leotard. Okay, that's true, but I'm actually a Wiccan, and, and we study witchcraft, but we do not dress anything like that. I mean, what's with your hat? My mother made it for me. Yeah, that's not my problem. You know, I have some information, actually, on being a real witch. Why don't you take this home and take a look at that? But I can't read. Yeah, that's not my problem. Maybe you could have your mother read it for you, because she's so smart. Bye. I'm telling you, this Mason guy is homeless, you guys. Okay, Sherlock, so you have deduced this by the fact that he smells, uh, his clothes, and the fact that no one knows him. Or that he's just from Norco. <laughs> <laughs> he's down there right now talking to Benny about that art shit. Okay, and as soon as shit starts turning up missing, guess what? You two clowns aren't gonna be doubting me then. Think about that. We're not fucking clowns, all right? <sighs> clowns, cops, clowns, cops, same shit, whatever, man. Well, at least the beer tap can't walk out. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you two guys get in character hey, here and man hey, up and chill out? Pulls fuck off. Pull some cop shit or something out of that hat, man. Seriously. <laughs> These are just costumes. Come yeah. on. Costumes worn by a couple of chicks, dude. You're like two limp dicks, man. Come on. Give me your cuffs, bro. No, I, I need those. For what? Dude? I promised my wife, and she's scarier than you, okay? Give me, then give me your cuffs. I gotta return these to my neighbor, all right? Yeah. You're gonna get them back. Stop it. Mm. Have another diamond. Oh, Jesus. God. Oh. Hi. You don't happen to have that, um, the red... Log egg? Yes. Your yes. husband came by for the whip earlier. He did, yeah. Do you know how to use it? Um, I think so. I don't want to show up to the party empty-handed, you know. Well, if you, uh, need any help. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm available. Hey guys, um, do you have any handcuffs I can borrow? Yes. Anything for a pretty lady. Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> but you needed those for your wife. Meg, it's Grace and Charlie. You okay in there? Hey, have you seen a fortune teller here? No. Did you guys hire one? No. But the funny thing is, a couple people have mentioned seeing her in our room, but every time I go there, nothing. Okay, I think you need to lay off the juice. <laughs> hey, I'm the love doctor, not a love patient. Hey, what was it you wanted to tell me about Mason? Mason's wife and child. He's married? No, no, he's widowed. Oh my god. It's so sad. You mean he's a widowed and a single parent? That must be rough. On his son's birthday, he was supposed to pick them both up, and they were going to a party. Mason ended up having to work late, and he asked his wife to drive, and he'd meet them there later. And they never made it. You mean he lost his son, too? Trunk driver. Mason blames himself. It's been about two years now, and he's really gone downhill fast. I mean, he's lost his job and his home. And he, he told me he lived down the street. He's homeless, Erin. Wow. That makes sense. Well, since then, he's been picking up the broken pieces mm -hmm. and making something very beautiful out of them. He's a very talented community developer, er, was. And actually, since he's been on the street, he's met a lot of people that are far worse off than him. One day, he approached us with this plan for building a sustainable homeless community. It's awesome. Grace and I decided to help him make it happen. You guys are amazing. You know that? <laughs> you are too gorgeous. That's why we wanted to talk to you a little bit about him and let you know he's a beautiful person. And Charlie and I think you should give him a chance. Grace, Charlie. You two promised me a dance, and I'm getting ready to head out. We're coming. Come on. Uh, I'm gonna wait here. Uh, Mason, you won't leave before I get a chance to talk to you, right? I'll stick around. Hey, everything all right? 
Yeah, fine. Where's Cole? Oh, he got a little tied up. I don't trust Palin or Obama. Yeah, first of all, I don't trust that homeless guy, you guys. Does anybody even know him? Can't say that I do. Yeah, exactly. You don't know him. I don't know what he knows him. And the thing is, I think he's really homeless. I it's haven't just... seen him before. Yeah, see? Yeah, me either. Dude smells like shit. Yeah. I smelled him, dude. <laughs> <laughs> and he's down here right now talking to, to Benny about his it's the, the Steuben stuff, that, that expensive art thing, that trinket. I think he's gonna jack it. And then some girl said her purse is gone. So what, so what does that tell you? Like, guys, you this is Jubilee? No, they're too busy partying. That's the whole deal. Party hardy. Well, yeah, they're, they're drunk. That's the thing. No one's listening to me because they don't understand the truth. I know the truth. <laughs> we got to tell them. I, no shit. That's what I said. So you want to get them? Let's go. Get them. Seriously. Yeah, yeah exactly. Go. Yeah. Let's go get them. Yeah. Hey, now. You see no, uh, you see no, you see no Jesus. Uh, no. Okay, do. Hey, Jesus. Hey, y'all, baby. Y'all right. Let's have some holy water. Oh, this is so cool. Nice crow. Come in, Aaron. How do you know my... Never mind. You're good. Ben and Julie, they're looking for you, by the way. I just spoke with them. Oh, what's this? You know, all my friends are plural these days. Ben and Julie, Charlie and Grace, Dave and Angela, even the gay prison inmates. And then there's me, AKA stud finder. I don't get it. I'm smart. I have a great sense of humor. I have a pretty, pretty good rack. Uh-huh. Up from the studio, gonna blast her out through your stereo. This is the sound that brings them down and they start wild and out. People turn their heads more now than they did in high school. I mean, I get it, I was a little chunky back then, but why do I only attract losers and bottom feeders? Do you know that I have two suitcases hidden under my bed, stuffed full of books on seduction and dating? Uh-huh, yeah, yeah. How to sexily adjust your undergarments while in line at Starbucks. How to toss your hair. How to kiss him first. That was a humiliating experience. He didn't kiss me back. What are you doing? That's not how you do it. Huh? Sit down. Sit down. Let me show you. Go. Ah. Got it now? All right, you try it. OK. There you go. You got it now, girl. You know, I had this one book called The Seven Secrets of Highly Seductive Women. <laughs> How stupid of a title is that anyway? And I decided that I was gonna try some of the tips from the book on my neighborhood ice cream man. You know, you gotta start somewhere. And he was kind of cute from a distance. Oh God, oh God, that guy. He had dried up pink and green sherbet dangleberries hanging from his chest hair. I mean, oh my God, how gross is that? I just, and then when I didn't follow through with my seduction technique, he started stalking me. Do you know how terrifying it is to have an ice cream truck pull up outside your house at midnight blaring the Mr. Softy tune? Oh God, every time I see an ice cream truck And don't even get me started on Donnie, the wolf boy. He was a one night stand that became a six month nightmare. Don't judge. Mama had an itch to scratch and he had a pole, but did he have to rub it on every single one of my friends? Why can't I just meet a guy that's normal, that doesn't cheat on me, that isn't a sociopath, that isn't just disgusting? What is wrong with me? Why, why do I have to bend myself into a pretzel? Why? Oh why? My God. What, what? I do believe I hear somebody urgently calling your name, honey. What? What do you guys want? What are you talking about? The fortune teller, she told me you needed me. 
What, what fortune teller? Okay, where is she? What? what? Seriously, guys, what the fuck do you put in these drinks? Wow. What are you talking about? I don't know, Aaron. Yeah. I think she needs to get laid. Oh, yes. I think. You know, I could write a prescription for Rufus. You should do that. Is she under the bed? Julie, come quick! Oh God, Mason's in trouble. Steal fine art and screwing cougars? Huh? Party's over, scrounger. Yeah. Look, I'm not here to make any trouble. Oh yeah? I think you should have dressed up as Robin Hood. Get a little more sympathy from me. This whole community building thing is bullshit, man, and I know it. What are you talking about? Uh, S Satan's purse, for one. That's what I'm talking about. She thinks that I didn't listen. What's gotten into you, baby? You have one of the doctor's drinks? You know what? Leave him alone, Donnie. Oh, great! Cougar to the rescue here! Yeah! Donnie, Donnie, just, just relax, okay? Mason's a good guy, all right? Really? He's a good guy? Who knows this good guy? I don't know this good guy. Do you know that nobody knows this good guy? We do. We do. Really? Oh, you do? You know what? You know why you know this good guy? Because you all see him squatting in the alleyway when you guys leave for work every morning. Dumping in the dumpsters. That's why you know him. Yeah, that's his home. Are you going on about Donnie? You, you want to, really? That, this right here, that's what I'm going on about. You know what this is? This was a tomato plant. And guess what's missing off this tomato plant? Tomatoes. You know why there's no tomatoes? This fuckwad come over here every night when you guys are sleeping and he takes the tomatoes and he eats them for vitamin C. So we can go googer hunting. Energy. It, it, it helps. I know it. Actually, Donnie, that's a Venus flytrap. Huh? Sexy. Suggester. Oh, I want one. <laughs> ow, 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 ow! What the fuck is going on in here? Hey, everybody! Strippers fighting living room! Whoa! Oh, baby, I didn't mean anything. I'm sorry. Nothing happened. Nothing at all. I can't see shit. Please don't hurt me. Erin, <laughs> you never told us that you were getting rid of such a cute baby. Oh, my God. He's all yours. <laughs> you! You sit. <laughs> I thought you guys were going to another party. A side, side track. track. <laughs> Let me show you how he likes it. Watch this, baby. Rabbi, music. Goodwill. Exactly. Ah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Where's Mason? Huh? Oh, your homeless boyfriend, that guy? He's not my boyfriend. Hey, I'm just gonna say it right now, seriously, you can do so much better than that, really. I mean, and guess what? Looks like Studfinder's going home alone tonight. I'm not. He's my friend. 
which is more than I can say for any of you. Aaron! Oh my gosh, Aaron, seriously, you're killing me right now. Would you rather go out trash like that or me? Think about it. Yeah, it's a hard one. <gasps> uh, okay. I'd actually rather go out in a lightning storm wrapped in tinfoil than go out with you. That doesn't even make any sense. So, like, fuck it, my mom was right about you. Of course she was. Yeah. And you can tell her tonight when you go home to her basement. Well done, my dear. Well done. The basement anymore. So, um, oh, you know oh, what? Get over here. Moving on to our next shot. Ooh, what are you doing here? Has everything calmed down down there? I thought Donnie threw you out. I don't know anything about that. I tell it out of there as soon as you started tearing him a new one. Listen, I was protecting you. Look. And I appreciate that. We need to get you out I of here. I want that. It's just. I thought the door was the new door downstairs. Oh. Wow. You are a take charge girl. I like you that. You know what? Get in the bathroom and clean yourself up. I'm gonna get you some clothes. On. I'm gonna go make sure the coast is clear. Okie dokie. Trick or treat! I'm craving for strong medicine. Pop my back on my feet and my heart again. So, you know what my favorite thing about you is? The way you can see your eyes looking at me through my glasses. <laughs> Refresher? Oh, yes, of course. Enjoy. Thank you, brother. That's my brother. I was thinking, uh, we could take this relationship a lot farther if you uh, can answer this one simple question. And what's that? Well, do you have a job? <laughs> Why? Because Elvis having a problem paying his rent. Really? No, not really. Just, well, just a little, just half the rent. Just my half. <laughs> Oh, but don't worry about it. You have room in your place, right? You, you live up the street, you said? Never gonna happen. All right, take care. See you guys later. Yeah, we're, we're gonna go find another one. All right. Pool party. Yeah, it is. Come on. That's a good stick. Hey, 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 All right. Well, you're high. What, what are you doing? Okay. I'm gonna kick your butt, dude, because blessed are the meek. Nah, oh, man, Jesus, you're nothing but a hound dog. I'm gonna kick your ass. Don't you understand that? You know, it's it's like, it's easier for a camel to walk through the eye of a needle than for a sideburn, pill-popping, fat dude like you to beat me again. Dude, don't be cruel. Don't be cruel, because I'm gonna hurt you so bad, I'm gonna make you shit that tuna. <laughs> Go ahead. Make my... Day, dude. You're an idiot. That's Clint Eastwood, man. No, dude. I totally said that one on the Sermon on the Mount, bro. Let's do it. Come on. I'm not scared of you. You're not scared of me. No, dude. All right. I'm going to break your arm. <laughs> then I'll just reheal it, dude, because I'm, like, eternal. You're eternal? Yeah, dude. Well, fix this. Oh, dude. Now oh. who's omnipotent, you pussy? I wasn't even... Oh. Wait. Wait. You got my weed, dude. Don't let the red crayon drive. <laughs> Fantastic party, Ben. Well, with friends like you, how could it be any less? Well, we see where Meg gets her charm. Our Meg. I know you think she's a handful, but trust us, she's all right. In fact, she helped us make a decision tonight. Big? Big decision. We decided we're going to give it a go. We're going to start a family. Oh my gosh, that's great. I mean, I would think Meg would deter prospective parents <laughs> to be. Not at all. We've been going back and forth on adoption. Yeah, a baby or a toddler. And a... Yeah, spending time with Meg. And then working with the kids in the church, which just made us decide we want to adopt a team. You two are brave. I, you know, people just give up on them. In fact, you know what Meg did last week? She walked up to one of our girls in a wheelchair and asked her if she wanted to fly. And the girl said yes. So Meg picked her up and put her on one of the tumbling pads, and then took one arm and one leg and started spinning her around. It started a chain reaction. All the many children heard us screaming and laughing hysterically. <laughs> so I asked Meg why she did that. And she said that when she first moved out here, she was very lonely. And so you took her to the park, and you did the same thing. And then all the other kids got jealous and wanted to join in. You gave her friends, Ben. You made her feel wanted. 
She's not half the trouble you're thinking. Uh, she's just trying to find herself like we all have. Well, we should be going. Yes. Thanks, you too. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> no problem. Bye. Bye. Out there, darling. I don't think so. We can't leave him there like that, though. Oh, no problem. You got I an have idea? this one handled. Okay. Mm -hmm. Good. What have you got up your. Whoa, where'd you get those? Oh, party favors, Republican convention. <laughs> Damn, I gotta go with you next time. I think so. You know, it just needs one more touch. Who's that? You gave it to me. What? Well, you know what? We, we just have to go. Where did you find the fortune teller? And who are you? <laughs> and you're a dude. I'll explain later. Where's Donnie? I have no idea, but you know what? The less we know, the better. Ben, it was a pleasure meeting you. You and Julie are fantastic hosts. Mason? You're the fortune teller. We actually found this outfit upstairs. I have no idea what's going on, but I guess she's still running around. Where is Jewel? Oh, she's probably uh, making sure that Megan doesn't kill anybody. <laughs> <laughs> we have to go, so I, I I can't say goodbye. Can can you let her know? Yeah, sure. Thank you so much. All right, let's go. Take care, you two. <laughs> so I want to hear more about your idea. Well, I know this great 24-hour place right around the corner. Oh, well, maybe I can buy you a coffee. How about that meal you owe me? Oh. <laughs> the person who makes a success of living is one who sees his aim steadily and aims for it unswervingly. That is dedication. I'm ready for my close-up. Fabulous! Hey, Ben. Have you seen Erin? Oh, she just left with the fortune teller. What fortune teller? Oh, oh, oh. I see hot dogs in your future. Romani! <laughs> Romani! That's a wrap. Yes, it is. So you can drop it now, friend. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> oh, that was exhausting. I'll uh. tell you what, keeping that up. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. Hey, how did the doggy cam go? Oh, it was great. I mean, between that and your stuff and all the other cameras, I yeah. think we got something here, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's going to be very special. Your friend with the yellow dress yeah. is going to... Well, she shouldn't see it, really, because she doesn't come off very <laughs> oh, good. But, God. But, uh, yeah, I think it's going to be great. great. Can I see the footage? Oh. <laughs> well, we, we will get our uh, first uh, cut to you in about three to four weeks. <laughs> three to four. Yeah, I think we'll wait. 
actually I gotta go to a Packer game in between. So it'll be more like five weeks and then you can give us some notes and we'll consider them. All right. Well, that sounds great. You can show yourselves out. All right. Can I grab a soda on the way out? No, no. I didn't think so. Good night. Ah, yeah, thanks. See you guys. Wow. That yes. was an interesting party. I know. Maybe next year we should invite just our actual friends. Yeah, either that or maybe we should charge admission. I think <laughs> maybe we could have it next year at my bar. Yeah, right. Well, you don't think I'm ever going to open it, do you? Well, I do, but, you know, sooner or later. It's going to have to be later. Why? Well, I was thinking maybe it's time we go back to the Virgin Islands and take Megan with us. Oh, my gosh. How are we going to do that? Well, you know what? I already did. No, you didn't. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Yes, I did. Are you kidding me? No. Why don't we go? <laughs> Just as soon as Meg's out of school. <laughs> Oh my you think gosh. she'll go for it? Are you kidding me? It's her favorite place. Oh, and I was also thinking that maybe it is time for that commitment ceremony. Are you kidding me? Oh, that is so sweet. <laughs> What'd she say? She said we are the best parents in the world. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, she wants a sandwich. <sighs> But you could say, thanks, Mom and Dad. Mm, that's very sweet. Let's go upstairs. All right. It's been a long night. Yeah.
fucker. I can't even wake a damn cop up. at me with such crazy eyes. Because I love you, son. Uh, I love you more than any mother has ever loved her, son. Do you love me in that creepy sort of way that we see oh, in the movies? Oh, yes, baby. Uh, oh, will you, will you, will you, will you, will you lock me in the closet again, please? Oh, yes, come oh, here, thank son. You. Oh, 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 o